All right, as you can see, this, this old wheelbarrow here has seen better days. We just basically have worn it out, and just now this handle broke. So, uh, we're gonna, we had already changed the tire out on this wheelbarrow because we wore that one out already. But uh, I sent, uh, I harbor freighted over two different sizes of these wheels. Uh, and that's the smaller one there and this is the bigger one. So we're going to swap these wheels out and put the bigger one on this one. Uh, we'll swap them out. We'll probably not even put one back on this. Uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, we'll, maybe we can repair this little barrel. Maybe not. We've already replaced the handles once. Now the bottom of it's rotting out. Uh, I don't know. Maybe. But anyway, we'll get the bigger tire on this because uh, it just kind of bottoms out basically with that small tire on it. It's just not a high enough profile to really use. The, of course, the threads on these are full of rust and cement. And while we were able to break them loose, we can't we can't get them to walk the rest of the way out. Put some air in this also, Tata. Maybe I can read it. No. All right, well, we got them swapped out. We swapped axles as well. Got it all oiled up. Oh, just like new. Yeah, it gives that a nice high profile now, because before, if you were five feet tall, you could use it because you were so much lower, but the handles up in the air were not fun with that wheelbarrow. All right, well, we've enlisted some help here to get this pit finished. Uh, yeah, that's how far I got. Um, sad to say, in a week. But, uh, I'm busy. I'm a sort of lazy on this pit. Uh, rain, procrastination, and a short duty cycle uh, left me to only go down that far. Uh, hopefully the, these guys can knock out a good bit of it this afternoon. Uh, Rayno is standing on what I got done, so I got down two feet, so we'll see if they can get down 
the other four feet, three feet today. So all the dirt that I had pitched out here, most of it anyway, has been taken down here for fill. All right, well, I don't feel so bad now. Because two guys in one day didn't get much farther than I did in four partial days, five partial days. So they're about, uh, they're going to go down about another foot, and then this will be complete. And we still have a little bit of soil around. So let's go over and see what all that ended up looking like over here. The seven didn't do any good on these uh, avocado trees. Uh, Marcel's not a happy camper. Look how far we got here. It took me I was down there mowing a lot longer than what I thought. I went down there about 1.30 and I thought I was coming up about 4. I went in and got him a bottle of soda to share for a, a late afternoon break and I come back out and it's, it's 5 minutes to 5. It's already quitting time so anyway they were able to get him a little soda. So it looks like we'll easily be able to fill up this pit here with the soil we're going to get and we'll go a long ways to getting this one filled up as well. So this will be raised and leveled out before we start pouring concrete and that'll take uh, so we've probably got two more days in digging and leveling and then I don't know how long it's going to take uh, to actually get the tanks in. See, today's Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. They're definitely not going to get done in one day on Saturday. So, they're probably not going to get done this week, but uh, we'll, see, we'll see what happens. But progress, slowly but surely. Thank you, everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.